We have been monitoring Buzzards Bay on a monthly basis since uh, October of 1987. October the 6th, we started our 28th year of continuous monitoring. What we've been trying to do is to put together patterns in Buzzards Bay, uh, both monthly patterns over the course of a year and interannual variability. Uh, from year to year, as you can imagine, in a place as dynamic as Buzzards Bay, the variability is huge. Uh, you get lots of changes both within the year as well as from year to year. What we do is that we um, sample at eight stations throughout the bay for a variety of parameters, uh, both biological, physical, and chemical. We measure temperature, salinity, uh, water chemistry, and then we look at uh, phytoplankton, which is the microscopic plants that are the photosynthetic base of the food chain. We collect samples for zooplankton, but we're starting to see some things now in terms of the temperature data that uh, we actually had not anticipated. If you look at certain months, we were surprised to find that we're getting significant increases in temperatures in May over at least 25 years worth of data and once we finish crunching the rest of it, it'll probably hold up until uh, right now. Simply stated, it seems like spring is coming earlier and faster than it has before. Uh, what the effects of this are going to be on the biology is not clear. What's going to happen with the overall warming in the planet, uh, there are a lot of predictions in terms of the ocean in general, uh, in terms of non-oceanic aspects of the planet, and the data is just flooding in. I mean, the patterns are, are pretty overwhelming and robust in terms of the fact that we are warming and that it's due to uh, human activity. We're running a large experiment with the planet, and we don't know what's going to be the result. I mean, in some cases, it may improve things, such as productivity in certain places where it's low now, but in other cases, it may change it. And we just simply don't know enough yet to know exactly what's going to happen. We'll find out. Hopefully, it won't be something we don't like that we can't fix, but things are going to change.